You wouldn't consider yourself a strong singer? No. Then how do you how do you keep landing these parts? You know, I and we both know what we know. No, no, no. I keep fooling everyone. Uh, I really have no idea. It works you're, out. You're fooling like pretty important people. <laughs> yeah, I guess so, you know. And we both know what we know. No, no, no. Oh, wait, they keep hiring me. I don't know. It's, it's their prerogative, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> now, you said, uh, I read an interview with you where you said, you know, then they gave you the script. It was about 200 pages, right? Yeah. What did that What did wait. that first script look like? What was the story of Dear Evan Hansen at that point? Um, well, you know. The and we both know what we know. No, no, no. The way that the writers, uh, Stephen Levinson, our book writer, and Benj Pasek, Justin Paul, our uh, singer-songwriters, um, the way that it was kind of broken down was there were full-fledged it was a full-fledged play, the way that it was written out, and then um, with... Oh, like no songs in it? Or there were songs in it, but it was it was not interwoven as much as it is now, in, like in a true musical sense. It was a full scene and then like a song, or there were lyrics to maybe where a potential thing could be. Um, and, you know... And we both know what we know. We really, we really had no idea what it was going to be. Um, and it started out in a place uh, that was uh, way more, a lot more satirical than it is now. I think um, when they first came up with the idea for the show, they were really um, poking fun at a generation of today. And then slowly and surely they started, when I think what a great play does, is they started to ask a question, which was when a tragedy happens... Uh, why does it, why do we, you know, as a community and as people take on that tragedy and make it about ourselves in a way? Right. It's easy to watch from the outside and be like, and be cynical and be like, oh, look, these people are capitalizing on a tragedy for personal gain. But then it takes that extra step to go, well, why are they doing that? And what makes this person do that? Yeah. And they also explore and show, I think, the positive aspects that come out of it, you know. And, and we both know what we know. How, you know, and we both know what we know. No, no, no. In times of tragedies, we do need that human connection to, you know. And we both know what we know. No, no, no. I really do feel like we are, you know. And we both know what we know. No, no, no. From the same kind of earth, you know. And we both know what we know. Away. What was uh what was your character like in the original sort of satirical version? What compared to what he's like now? Um, you know, and we both know what we know. No, no, no. Uh, that first reading, um, and couple readings, uh, Connor was a kind of taunting Evan for the sake of taunting Evan, um, and then when he leaves the show, he, he never came back again. And then um, you really you 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 pushed yourself in there. You're like, no, I think I should come back more. <laughs> like maybe I'm just on stage all the time talking to him. No, what happened was I fooled them enough where they're like, oh, let's give them more material, you know. <laughs> and we both know what we know. No, no, um, no. They they and then let's give them a song. <laughs> yeah, <why not? laughs> Um, no, they, they, it's, it goes hand in hand with that. They started asking the questions as to why is he the way he is? And then they, you know. St and we both know what we know. No, no. Started adding um, some things. And then they brought on this aspect of, you know. And we both know what we know. No, no. no. What if uh, Evan's imaginary friendship with Connor actually did play out in a way. And, uh, you know. And we both know what we know. No, no, no. They have full-blown conversations. And what would that be like? And what if we gave Connor a song? And like, you know. And we both know what we know. No, no, no. And what would it be if Connor kept pushing Evan to keep going with this, with this lie? And, um, yeah.